11.96% return on investment. Look at my dog Dodo's face. He knows that their agent is not telling the truth. You want to know the real numbers? Stay tuned. Ciao! If you are new to the channel, my name is Fabrizio Cravero and he is Dodo. We invest in UK property from overseas. This channel is all about property investment for UK and overseas investors. This is what I receive in a daily basis in my mailbox. And that's one of the several ways I find my investment properties. And of course, one of the many aspects I take into consideration when I buy an investment property is the return on investment. Straight to the point, is the return on investment or ROI of this property really 11.96% or maybe slightly less? Subscribe to the channel, press the like button and I will show you the truth. And by the way, download for free my return on investment calculator. You can find it in the description below. So those are the data I extracted from the brochure. This is a free old three bedroom terrace house in Moston, which is 15 minutes car from Manchester Town Centre. Purchase price £120,000, rental income £1,196 per month, refurb £6,000 and sourcing fee £3,000. So what's the formula of the return on investment? Annual profit divided by the money invested times 100. Let's have a look. Annual profit is the annual rent minus all the costs involved in holding the property. That means £1,196 minus the management fee because I'm not managing myself any of my properties. I'm looking for a passive income. So usually it's about 10% of the monthly rent. In this case, £119. Minus the landlord insurance, approximately £25 per month. Minus the maintenance, let's say £50 per month because over time I may need to replace the carpet and change the boiler, etc. I always like to put money aside every month for those costs. The target when you invest in property, eventually it is to never ever touch your wallet again. And because I'm very conservative, I always count only 11 months of rental, as I consider one month void every year, even though this never happened. But let's deduct £100 per month for the void period. Remember, this is a freehold property, so there is no ground rent and service charge to be paid. But if you buy a leasehold property, those are extra costs that you need to take into consideration. And let's say that we are going to buy the property in cash, so there will be no mortgage payment involved. So now we have £1,196 minus management fee £119 minus insurance 25, minus maintenance 50 and minus void period 100. So the cash flow or the net real income will be 902 pounds. So as you can see, we are about 25% less than the gross rent. That's something to notice very well. The ROI formula is the annual profit divided by the money invested. So we now know that the annual profit is 902 pounds. But let's check the money invested. Of course, to make the deal more attractive, the agent uses the purchase price as the amount of money invested. But I want you to be successful and I want you to subscribe to the channel. So let me tell you the real truth. Let's see the real cost of buying an investment property. Under £20,000 is the purchase price. But then the government is going to charge you for the stamp duty. By the way, check the video up here if you want to know how to pay much less in stamp duty. But let's say that you are going to buy this property today and the stamp duty will be 3% of the purchase price. And remember to add 2% if you are an overseas investor. So let's say you are based overseas. Therefore, you will be paying 5% of £120,000 for the stamp duty, which is £6,000. Then you will need a solicitor to proceed with the transaction and the fee is approximately £1,200 and the surveyor to check the condition of the property and the fee is approximately £600. We then add £3,000 for the sourcing agent and £6,000 for the refurb. Plus, 
we also need to add approximately 10% of the refurb cost for the project manager that will follow the refurb on your behalf. We add another 600 pounds for that. So the total cost, you see that now they go up all the way to 137,000 pounds and 400. If you find it a bit too complicated, don't worry. In the description below, there is a link to download for free my return on investment calculator. It is super useful. That's what I use every time before I buy any of my investment properties. But now, finally, let's calculate the ROI, the real return on investment. Annual profit, which is 902 pounds per month, times 12, because we are considering the annual profit, divided by the total money invested, 137,000 pounds and 400, multiplied by 100. Here we are, the return on investment is 7.87%. Wow, but the agent said that it was 11.96%, isn't it? That's quite an important difference straight away. So now you know why Dodo is hiding here, so mad at the agent. <laughs> this video is so important because you need to know how hard your money are working for you. That's the whole purpose of this channel to educate you and help you to make real informed decisions. So subscribe to the channel and like this video because this will help other property investors as well to find those informations. And all together, we will be investing with knowledge and create our financial freedom. Dodo, myself, are looking forward to see you in the next video.